in our top stories this afternoon, a final farewell to the Queen of Soul. Right now, mourners are celebrating Rita Franklin's life at the Greater Grace Temple in her hometown of Detroit. And right now, you're looking at a live picture inside that temple, and there is not an empty seat in the house. The pack service is expected to last more than six hours. The star-studded celebration of her life includes celebrities, music greats, and, of course, hundreds and hundreds of fans. And from an American icon to an American hero, Senator John McCain's body now lying in state in the Capitol Rotunda. Earlier today, a somber service was held to honor the former presidential candidate, Democrats and Republicans coming together, pouring rain, reflecting the mood in Washington as Paul Burns carried the casket solemnly up the steps. And yes, it is the final farewell of summer. The people are taken to the roads, the rails, and even the skies this holiday weekend. The Port Authority expects more than 4 million vehicles to cross its bridges and tunnels over Labor Day weekend. Look at that coloration on her. That's granite, granite, carpet python. Oh, actually it's a him. Yeah, he's beautiful. Uh oh, sorry, I didn't want to show you that. But yeah, he just went to the bathroom. He just shed it and went to the bathroom. Or went to the bathroom and then shed it. So he's looking for food. Uh, mine are too small to feed him right now, so the one that I have, I'm to go buy him some tomorrow. There he is, six years old. I want to get a female for him. Maybe breed him. But at least one, I'd like to have a pair, have them together. I think it's healthier. Oh, sorry. I want to show that. No, I didn't get a chance to clean it out. I just saw he shedded. So I just grabbed the camera and went to flip it on. And turn the light on. I want to show you his coloration. Look at those colors. Look at that. Isn't that nice? It's gorgeous. Gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that head. Despite all the flames, no one in the area actually lost power. Badass snake. Crews are working now to repair those charred parts and wires. Yeah, I wanted to show you guys because I'm uh, while he's out there. Also, he goes back into his box over there. He stays there. So I know right now he's out looking for food. He'll have to wait a day. I'll get him tomorrow. He'll get the mice tomorrow. Feed him like two or three live mice. Oh, maybe like three or four. Three or four full grown live mice. I feed him live. He's used to live. Um, I like it better. They just throw them in there and walk away. I won't throw all four, I'll throw them one at a time. But yeah, he is nice. He is nice. Detectives say the man walked up to the boy inside the Union Square Barnes and Noble yesterday afternoon, groped him, and then ran off. The town was shaken up, but not hurt. All right, guys, and that's my carpet python. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. He just shed it, so yeah. Uh, he just shed it. I won't do a, a feeding video because uh, uh, I like to put live on YouTube. I don't think it's cool. A lot, a lot of people get offended, so uh, I'll just feed them tomorrow and show them after. Do a video after probably tomorrow or Sunday. I'll feed them tomorrow. Maybe I do a video tomorrow after or Sunday. All right, guys. I'm uh, if something else comes up, I'll do another video. Take care. Hope you enjoyed. Bye. Thanks for watching.